Joining me now for a fair and balanced debate, Congressman Stephen Lynch, a Democrat from Massachusetts, and Thaddeus McCotter, a Republican from Michigan. Uh, Congressman Lynch, let me start with you. Why is the Department of the Interior preventing Border Patrol agents from, from patrolling 40% of our border with Mexico? Well, I understand that uh, the Department of the Interior has uh, jurisdiction over some of these areas. Uh, they are wilderness preserves and refuges, and uh, they are limiting. I guess the, the Border Patrol agents have to patrol either by foot or by horseback in certain areas. But in my mind, we should be able to work together here to allow DHS to, and the Border Patrol to conduct that, that surveillance and patrolling. Uh, it shouldn't be uh, one or the other. We should be able to protect our national security and our natural resources at the same time. Understood. Congressman uh, McCotter, isn't the federal government then putting the, the concerns of the environmentalists ahead of our own safety concerns? Well, first, I think you're going to find a lot of bipartisan agreement, as we heard from my colleague, Representative Lynch. And what we're seeing is more bureaucratic turf war that is, I believe, setting back national security. Fundamentally, the protection of human life is the overarching goal of the United States government in terms of the defense. Now, if you care about the natural resources, you also have to recognize that the criminal drug smugglers and others who've come across the border and have killed American citizens, such as Robert Krentz, mm -hmm. are going to continue to despoil that natural re the natural resources there. So if you want to help protect the resources and, more importantly, protect American lives, you should allow for the Border Patrol to come down there and well, do their So job. you brought up a great example, and that is that Arizona rancher whose family had been ranching on that land for nearly 100 years, Robert Krentz, and it's believed that uh, his killer came across through part of our area that is not patrolled by the Border Patrol and that there had been some towers uh, that would help look out for people crossing the border, but those very towers had been taken down in order to protect endangered species. Uh, Congressman Lynch, how do you explain something like that? Well, I think you need balance. Uh, we need to have, uh, when you talk to the people who actually represent the border area, uh, they want more resources out there. They want, I guess, the, the fence is, is uh, not consistent all the way across. I actually voted for the security fence for national security reasons. But uh, it's a real hodgepodge. There are areas where the fence is just a, a picket fence sort of uh, type thing. There are posts. Then there are other areas where there's actually a, a physical barrier. So we, we need to sort of look at, look at the, uh, the border area there, do what we can to preserve the, uh, you know, the natural resources there, but also provide security to those families because that is the first role of government. Well, something certainly has to be done. How confident are you, gentlemen, that Congress will pass something like this? Uh, which well, gentleman? I, I think that... <laughs> gentlemen, okay. Well, uh, Congressman McCotter, then, how, how confident are you that Congress will pass this? Well, we'll have to see what the leadership in the House wants to do with it. I think that you're going to find broad consensus among the rank and file members on both sides of the aisle. We understand the number one goal of the United States government and homeland security is to protect ranchers, to protect Americans along that border, and defend our territorial integrity. The balancing act is necessary, but only to this extent. The overarching goal is to protect human life, and protecting the natural resources will come secondary. Mm -hmm. And uh, uh, Congressman Lynch? Yeah, I think I think uh, Mr. McCarter has it right. This this as he said at the outset, this seems to be more of a turf war between two agencies. Uh, look, we we should be able to have uh, in the Interior Department and Ken Salazar and and uh, Secretary Napolitano work this out between those two agencies. Uh, we've got to be able to protect our natural resources and protect the border at the same time. There's no question about it. Well, it's a turf war that I think a lot of Americans will agree is definitely affecting our security here at home. Uh, gentlemen, thank Absolutely. you so much for joining us. Uh, that is McCotter from thank the you. state of Michigan and Congressman Stephen Lynch from Massachusetts. Thanks so much and have a great weekend.